California, everyone should be excited about it. It's election season, so it is the season for every governor, every senator, every congressman and con congresswoman. 2024, wake up. For them to pretend like they've been doing a great job all along. And here's a perfect example of what all these politicians think that you believe in this video right here. This is what they actually think is happening. Anytime they actually do anything good for their people, this is what they feel like right here. They, they just feel like uh, uh, I'm, I'm having a nice glass of Chardonnay. All my idiot voters right here, my idiot voters right here, they're all just sucking it in. And here's, here's every governor just saying, look at me. Uh, I told you I'm a good governor. Right here, and here's a perfect example of it. Governor Newsom orders California state agencies to start clearing out homeless encampments. What? <laughs> what? This is like Governor Abbott all of a sudden deciding, uh, maybe we'll send some people to the border to stop all this crazy stuff happening. Governor Gavin... Gavin Newsom ordered state agencies Thursday to start removing homeless encampments on state land. State land, of course. In the boldest action yet following a Supreme Court ruling allowing cities to enforce bans on sleeping outside in public spaces. So in public spaces. And here's Governor Newsom right now uh, on the streets of California. <laughs> He put out this tweet after he did <laughs> said that, put the ban, the executive order to remove homeless encampments in the state. No more excuses, he says. I mean, this tweet is just, it's insane. It's insane. Now, now, now during election season, he can say, look, California, we're doing everything we can for the homeless encampments. We're making people's lives better. What are you talking about, uh, Republicans? What are you even saying? Do you even know the rules? It's incredible how these people just lie. As if he hasn't been doing this. I mean, he hasn't been doing this. No more excuses. We provided the time. We provided the funds. Now it's time, I don't understand this part, for locals to do their job. Local police, local everyday citizens on the street, do your job. Get rid of these sickos. <laughs> Get rid of these disgusting human beings. <laughs> yeah, I like this one. Yeah, it's the locals' fault. <laughs> I just... <laughs> I, this is the times in my life I actually love politics. Because it's just so ridiculous. Because the average human being sees this and they're like, Oh, great. Thank God he's doing something. Why now? You have to ask, why now? Why did it take so long? And is it even going to make a difference? Are you going to enforce it? Are things to act actually going to change? It's like these people create these problems in your life to make your life a living hell until you start bitching about it enough. Then they'll start to actually think about changing it. It's like it takes Joe Rogan to talk about it all day. And again, here's politicians. Anytime they, they do one thing to make your lives better, it's like, Maybe today we're not going to send any money to Ukraine, but you know what? There's enough drugs on the street and crime. I guess we'll get rid of the encampments. What? I mean, what an insane thing. There are simply no more excuses, he says. It's time for everyone to do their part. Are they in power? No, exactly. I'm calling BS Newscom, <laughs> says Willie. He's doing that to make room for illegals. Oh, my God. Mikhail, how dare you say that? It's probably spot on. <laughs> There's simply no more excuses. Newsom's decision garnered praise from the local elected officials and business groups. Yeah, no duh. Imagine, I mean, could you imagine having a business in California? Just as Kamala says, she's up in these streets. Not in these streets. Who said they left no options to address homeless encampments before the Supreme Court ruling. San Francisco Mayor London Breed recently said that the city will start an aggressive campaign to clear encampments across the city in August. Her office noted that the governor's order does not affect city's operations. I applaud Governor Newsom's emphasis on urgency. <laughs> I'm 
happy election year, everyone. Mm. <laughs> Newsom just sitting at home right now. He's like, oh, these idiots. Mm. They'll never, 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 ever, ever get me out of office until I run for president now. Now all the Californians can stop bitching and they'll be like, oh, you know, you know, Newsom's actually pretty good. What makes you say that? Uh, he's a Democrat and he finally cleaned up the streets.